air flavored chicken on the grill, combining it into a delicious taco themed dish. Talk about a fusion of flavors. Absolutely. I'm back here outside grilling with grill mayor, Craig Jones, and his lovely wife, the princess of fire, Gay <laughs> Jones. You. Guys, what inspired you to create this dish? Well, you know what? One of my wife's favorite dishes is the beer marinated tacos that we make It is at home. so true, it's delicious. She beer is a great it. marinade. Yes. So what we were thinking is, you know, since we have these buns, people will probably have a lot of hot dog buns. Yeah. You know how you always have more buns than whatever you're trying yeah. to cook, right? And they wind up so, in the freezer and yeah. they get weird and sad looking. There's like one left in the bag. There's no fun in yeah. that, right? Yeah. So that, let's take that and instead of having the tortilla, we'll use a hot dog bun. Nice. So let me show you how we do this. What kind of chicken, uh, what cut from the chicken are you using here? So I'm using a boneless, skinless chicken thigh. The reason for that is it, it does taste a little bit better. It's moist. It's uh, harder to dry out mm -hmm. as well. And then the boneless and the skinless, because we don't really need that for all this. Less work for you. Tell us about the marinade. Okay, so the marinade, we're going to start over here with a cup of, I like using a good Mexican dark beer. And then we're going to use, this is sesame oil. So we want a little bit of oil in the marinade so that when I put the chicken on the grill, it won't stick. Now to add some flavor, we've got some oregano, a little cayenne, and some garlic, and then salt. So this is actually going to be, so the salt is gonna act like a brine. So we just stir it together like this. Then and how we'll, much marinade per chicken thigh? So I'm gonna put about six uh, chicken thighs oh, in okay. this, and I put them in a little plastic bag, yeah. and you just put it in there. Then I like to put the bag in, back into a bowl, so in case the bag leaks, it's not going all over your refrigerator. Are you a proponent of poking holes in the thing that you're marinating? It depends on what it is. I don't on the chicken, and you'll see it, because this acts as a perfect brine that right. infuses the flavor. How long do you marinate it for? So I'm gonna go four to six hours on okay. this. Sometimes overnight is fine. The nice thing about this is you can prep this all ahead of time, then yeah. when people come over, we just come out and cook. So let me show you how easy this okay. is to cook. So, now I've got some chicken on here now that we've been cooking. Now you notice I use these tongs here. These tongs have not touched any raw food yet. Boy, so it's I'm so tender it just pulls apart when you flip it even. Uh, well, and that's probably the beauty of the chicken thigh. Yeah. Now, as I put these raw ones on that we've it's already marinated, tongs. I'll yeah. use separate tongs. Then we use a separate part of the grill over there. Now these will go quick. We're putting these on direct and it'll only take five minutes a side. Does it ruin it if when you go to check if it's done, you cut it open a little bit? I always um, wonder that, if that ruins the cooking process. I don't think it's gonna ruin the cooking process on chicken. Sometimes on meat, you'll have a lot of the uh, inside uh, come Juices out. Juices come yeah. out. So once it's done, then what? So then what we do, let's come on over here. <laughs> we then cut it up into little strips, yeah. and then we put on some cheese and then some salsa. And that's so, it. And that's it. So very easy. We take the hot dog bun. Uh -huh. We cook it the same way we did last time, where we cook it indirect. So the outside of the bun is toasty. Mm. The inside is soft. And my wife, I can hear her making noises yeah. already. So here you go. Oh, Gay's oh, drooling. Thank you. She's drooling. Oh. Yes. Oh, now really tell us favorite. about, I won't ask Gay, because you just took a big bite. You, <laughs> these are your favorite buns for mm. people just joining us. Where did you get your buns? So these mm. buns are farm to market buns. It's a new collaboration they've done with Boulevard Brewery. So all local. And this is, they call it their unfiltered wheat buns. They just released today. They just released today. So you're so the first you ones to hear about it. First one to get her hands on these buns. That's right. <laughs> I wanted to say that. Craig and Gay Jones, thank you for showing us how to make beer marinated chicken tacos. Fabulous. Super easy. And we're not done with you yet. We're going to keep up with the Joneses all morning long. Coming up, oh, in a few minutes, we're going to check back in with you and you're doing something magical with pineapples on oh, the yeah. grill. Oh, yeah. And a secret ingredient. So we had hot dogs. Now we got the beer marinated, marinated chicken. Then we have the pineapple on the grill. Now we also want to do a final check in with Bill, who's hanging out at the zoo with Dixie. Oh.